to nothing quite like a rivalry game in college hoops. Aggies and Miners meeting at the Don for the second time this week. The men actually played Tuesday with the Aggies coming out on top. Could the Aggie women make it two for two this week? Luke Litton, he knows the answer. He joins us now, Luke. Trevor, this kind of feels like deja vu, the battle of I-10 all over again, but this time for the women. Just like the men, the Miners are in desperate need for a win as they sat at 2-6 and six before this game, while the Aggies are solid 6-3. and three. These two teams only meeting one time this season, so really, no room for error if you want those bragging rights. Brooks Salas and the Aggies looking for win number 7, taking on Lulu McKinney and the Miners. And if there was one way to start for the home team, this would not be it. Straight off the opening tip, Tamara Seda knocks it back, but Tamara William steals it, gets the quick bucket and the lead so next possession off the miss it's William again active on the board going nearly 92 feet the euro step and the finish she had a monster game with 15 points and 16 boards and the Aggies start this game on an 8 to 2 run while UTEP's first basket almost eight minutes in the ball game and here it is Susanna Poos with the good positioning the easy lay-in she had a double double of her own with 11 points and 12 rebounds and then we have UTEP Seda at six foot four she's almost taller than me too big down low and gets the quick turnaround to fall. UTEP went in the break down just three, but in the second half they had to come back down 13, down five right here. 40 seconds left, a chance to cut it to two, but McKinney misses the wide open three. You won't get a more clean look than that right there. The Miners couldn't capitalize, and they fall 67 to 59, and they fall to two and seven on the year, while the Aggies improve to seven and three. Yeah, I just thought we were, we you know, we were too lethargic. You know, you gotta you gotta be crisp. You gotta make hard cuts. You gotta sprint back. I mean, just that first five minutes, we 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 didn't uh, we didn't come out and set a tone. We need some more experience out on the floor because playing a lot of freshmen is is, is tough for us. Well, unfortunately, it's about to get even tougher for the Miners as they will host a 7-3 Pittsburgh team next Monday at 4 p.m., while the Aggies will take part in the Play for K shootout in Vegas next week. And, Trav, so far, it looks like the Aggies have the Miners' number this year. We'll see if the men can even the series up on the 30th on Friday. Well, it sounds good. The Aggies very comfortable, almost too comfortable at the dawn. Well, speaking of...